Hi, it's Tessa and I'm back today to do a hair tutorial using my Remington clipless curling wand. It's tapered. I got it at Walmart for $24.99. I love this thing. So to start with dry hair, um, all I put in it was mousse a little bit. I'm going to wrap it up and I think this is like the second, no, third time I tried doing this. I tried to do it two other times and things went awry. <laughs> I'm using the Gotta Be Guardian Angel Flat Iron Balm. I love the smell of this stuff. It smells so good. Just a little bit because you don't want to make your hair wet. Then you split it down the middle on both sides and I'm going to do three sections on each side. Now I have thin hair so you just determine how much you want to use depending on the thickness of your hair and how much you have. Then you just wrap it away from your face and hold it for five seconds. And then let go. Now I have this set to 360 degrees and I lock it in place so it doesn't move when I bump the buttons with my fingers. Um, then you just move on to the next piece and wrap. Count to five. This comes with a full glove. I don't use it. It just gets in the way. Um, if you're nervous at first using one of these, then by all means use the glove, but once you get it, the, it down, you'll, you might still burn yourself, but it won't, not nearly as many times as when you first get it. I burnt my hand the other day on it. I don't know if you can see that. It's almost gone now. Okay, so that side's done. We're going to switch to this side. And as you can see, I'm kind of holding this thing upside down and then starting at the top and wrapping down. So, I have a bunch of videos I need to film. Um, I was trying to get things together last night so I could film them all. Last weekend, I took the weekend off and didn't film anything. So now I don't have any videos left to go up. So I have a bunch of stuff I have in mind to do. And now it's the end of June. No, it's the end of July. And um, I'll have to do my July favorites as well. Plus I got a bunch of new stuff that I want to show you. And what else? Oh, I'm going to also film, as soon as I'm done with this hair tutorial, I'm going to film a phone case video because I um, got a bunch of phone cases off of eBay for my phone. And I want to show them. And everybody has an iPhone, and I don't. And I figured other people want to see what other phone cases are available for other phone styles. So I'm going to do the phone cases for my phone, which is the Samsung Galaxy S4, which I love. I've probably had it about a month or two now. So you let your next layer down. And pick up a piece of hair, wrap it. Some people let like a one inch tail. I don't. My hair is so fine, it'll look like it's just stick straight on the bottom. And I do not like that look. Next Saturday, I'm finally going to get my hair cut and colored. It is looking. I went three and a half months this time between a cut and color, and it was way too long. I should have never went that long between a cut and color because um, two months is probably the maximum. And I went too long. But that's okay. I'll know better next time. So this is a pretty quick hair look. Um, when you get to the back, it doesn't really matter which way you curl it. Just whatever way is easier. I feel like I should be talking about something else. Oh, what am I doing today? I have to go to Walmart for groceries and a couple... need some more concealer. I'm almost out of concealer. Um, I like the Maybelline Age Rewind Concealer. Gosh darn it, that thing breaks on me every time I buy it. 
the top comes off and it's so annoying so I like want it but then I know I can't get the product out when I buy it so oh it's so frustrating I wish they would fix it but whatever what are you gonna do about it this is a really quick hairstyle did I say that already probably This thing gets so hot and it curls so quick. I just love it. And it's the kind of curl you cannot get with the traditional curling iron. They're more of a flat round, flat and round, a flat um, curl, like a ribbon. And these are more spirally. Okay, last layer. Heat protectant. I would curl my hair like this every day, but I'm worried about drying my hair out too much from all the heat. So I only try to do it like once or twice a week, maybe just on the, maybe once during the week and once on the weekend, because I don't want to dry my hair out. <laughs> Excuse me. Sorry if I sound like I'm out of breath or I can't breathe properly, but I'm still having all these sinus problems. I go back to the doctor in August. That was the earliest appointment I could get. So I still have another, what, week and a half until the doctor's appointment. Um, I did pretty good on the steroids, but I felt like I wasn't on them long enough. They just, I don't know. I'm frustrated. And then I was doing pretty good. I cut out gluten and dairy out of my diet, and then I added dairy back in because I was doing a food elimination diet. And as soon as I added the dairy back in, I got real sick again. But I got allergy blood work done, and nothing came back as an allergen, so I'm perplexed. Hopefully the ENT will have more answers. Something I'm coming in contact something I am coming in contact with is making me sick and I wish we could just figure it out because it is so frustrating. <clears throat> Sinus problems are not fun. <coughs> Excuse me. So we'll see what he has to say. He did give me this uh, steroid, an inhaled steroid, but I have not used it because it says on there, like one of the first side effects is like it can eat like a hole in your nose, like up in here, and it can whistle when you breathe. Really? Whistle when you breathe? Like who wants to take that? <sighs> and then they're like, oh, you have to oil your options. Well, that is not an option. That's disgusting. I'm not going to take something that, that that strong. What if it got clear up into my head and ate a hole into my brain? I mean, I don't know if that would really happen, but it, it freaks me out when I think about it. I cannot be using that. That is horrible. Here's the part where I always have a problem. I get into where my bangs are. And I don't know what to do with them. Usually I just pin them back and don't even bother, but because if you curl them and then pin them back, they stick out. So we'll see here. We'll try it. If not, there's always bobby pins to fix it. Okay, now I'm going to take um, my mirror and look at the back and see if I missed anything, because I usually do miss something. Yep, right here. Doesn't look very curly. There's a spot. Any other ones? Nope, that's the only one. Curl this, and then I'm going to spray it with hairspray. And 
normally I let this cool for a while, but since I'm doing this video and I hate to edit on Window Movie Make Windows Movie Maker, I'm just going to um, spray it and then let the hairspray dry for a second. This is just the Dove Style Plus Care Extra Hold Hairspray. I like this hairspray. Doesn't make your hair like a rock. So then you just finger comb it out. And then if you have any spots that you feel needs more attention, you can just go back in and give it to them. Just finger comb. I don't know if my head like my hair parted like this. Very wonky. Um, I think I'm going to bobby pin it. Pull that up. And bobby pin those back. I have a bobby pin. Okay. I can fix that up a little bit after I finish finger curling it. I have a hair in my mouth. Ah. All right. So I'm turning around here and see what it looks like in the back. to curl this a little more a little closer to my head so you can actually see a little more volume up there and that's the problem with having fine hair is lacking volume it's always an issue so I'm just going to wrap this around so it's a little tighter to the scalp hard to torque volume into fine hair, especially at the crown. Okay, so now let's do this again. piece here that's straight. So I'm going to just wrap that around the one. Just a curly end. There we go. Fix that up. Okay. Looks good. My hair's falling out so bad now that it's summer. All right, let's turn around and look at the back. Look at those pieces. See how it got more curl up in here after I am um, added some extra ones there. Okay, that looks good. All right, I like it. All right, so I'm just gonna spray this and the look is complete. <clears throat> just a light coat of hairspray will be fine. This style lasts all day, not a problem. All right. So that is the hair look using the Remington tapered clipless curling wand that I got at Walmart. All right, thanks for watching and I will see you again soon. Bye-bye.